are now here at the Davao International Airport. So it's another trip for our second trip this year. And this time, this is a family trip bound for Cebu. So matagal na namin to na book last year pa lang. And we are now going to Bantayan, Cebu. Pero tayo kasamang dalawang senior citizen, which are my parents. So kami rin tayo kasamang isang child. So this is totally our two family trip going to Cebu. We will be staying to Cebu for at least three days, three full days. And ngayon nga, Saturday, ng gabi, yung flight namin papunta sa Cebu. Itim pa natin lahat. So we are now going to the bus stop, going to the North Bus Terminal para sa ating Bantayan. So we will be traveling in Bantayan at night para makatipid din kay content na accommodation. <laughs> May mga lectures all the way, but along, behind, along the way going to the bus stop. Yeah, nasa SM City na po kami guys. So yung North Bus Terminal is situated pa siya ngayon dito sa North Bus, ah, sa may SNC. Kasi under renovation ang North Bus. Yung bus namin guys, it arrived. So tentatively baka makarating kami ng around 3 a.m. beach right after natin nag-church kanina kasi birthday po natin today yay so actually this ship is uh, has a uh, connection with my birthday so after natin doon sa church is nagbibigbibihis muna tayo kasi magsastart na tayo mag island happy I mean mag land tour pala this is my third time visiting Kota Beach I still love Kota Beach up until now Oh, photo of the beach. beach, guys. It's still a very mesmerizing. Father, mau lagi nak kong gigong, gidaghan manggut ni mu. Mama, kamera tuan itu. Oh, 
Okay, na yung sasakyan namin na multi-cab guys. We rented that for 2,000 pesos. I think 5 destinations na yung visit tayo. So let's go go. Check our first stop. The same old routine. So this is my third time here in Omar Cheka. Mango. Ob ob mango. Guarded Echo Park. I think parang may 50 pesos na entrance here. Ito na yung publish rates nila guys. 75 pesos na yung entrance fee. So before when we got here, 50 pesos pa yun. Ngayon 75 na. So, lino ang dagat din guys. Compared sa Santa Fe, kung ano huwag kasi yung ano, pabor ng amihan. Dito kasi is, pag amihan, dito naman yung kalma. So, mag-lunch kami dito somewhere sa kanila parang Mercado area. Eh, yeah. yeah. Mga barbecue, barbecue-ish. Guys, we have arrived at Kota Beach. So, ito yung room namin. Nasa third row siya ng resort. It's very spacious, guys. So, may a little bungalow. Father is there, sitting on the there. Meron mga quiet hala yan. And she, he is not charging his cell phone. Ano, dako pa siya space sa likod, oh. The mother. And the best part is, andito sa loob. Ayan, oh. Lima, may direkta na. Lima, lima, lima. Ay, silig. Mama, papa, dire mo, te. Pero, ah, dire rin na siya. Mutang tiling, matulog na. Hoy! Kevin! Nagawa ah. <laughs> mo lang mag-iis si Kevin, uy! <laughs> Ay, ayan. So, it's already 6pm na, guys. Nakatulog ako ng tatlong oras kanina kasi wala pa ni Guru. Look at Kota Beach during the evening. Lively ng lahat na lang area. Parang may restaurant. Ano ba ito? Ano ba ito? Guys, it's dinner time. And melon par babay barbecue good night in Kota Beach. So we're here to have my dinner for my birthday. Let's 
go. Ay, let's hop na tayo. Go, 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 the father. Okay, it's day two, full day two. In Kota Beach. In Bantayan. So, karon is mag island hopping me. Go, ban sila father. Mother. How long, father? Mother. Mm -mm. We will be going to the Virgin Island. We, uh, I've been in Virgin Island way back 2018 ba yun? Uh, 2020 when we had uh, nagkasama ko yung mga bestie dito and right now is pupunta ulit tayo ng Virgin Island so iba na yung process ngayon compared before kasi before in front of the Cotta Beach or sa public beach pwede lang makuha ng bangka this time is uh, na-regulate ng tourism so meron na silang uh, docking area for the island happy tsaka most of the entrances here sa Bantayan nag-increase to talaga sila ng mga parang 50% to 75% increase sa kanilang dati ng mga ano uh, prices so sa Virgin Island before 200 pesos siya for the first two packs tapos succeed succeeding packs so landed, ano na siya 100 pesos but this time fixed sila lahat 325 pesos na per head diba more than 100% Dito sa may Ukoy guest house guys, ang docking area ng Bantayan. I mean, ang island happy ng Virgin Island. So from Kota Beach, it took us mga 10 minutes to 15 minutes drive. Then 40 pesos per head yung fare. So walking lang muna, going to the dock. So yung island happy nila dito was is already regulated by the government. Kasi before, Pwede na ang mag-island hopping in front of Porto Beach. May mga bangka na. So right now, wala na doon. So, isa na lang yung docking area. Kung hindi nyo dito ba ang lasa na. Ukoy guest house. Ayan. So, dito na yung island hopping station. And then, from here, you can now already see, already see the Virgin Island. Tapos, yung kabila is Helan Pagan Island. The fare here is, the bangka is 1,000 pesos, good for 5. If my excess people na, mag-add na ng 200 pesos each. Okay, dyan yung registration area guys. So sa boat, nababayaran mo, 1,000 per boat, with for 5 packs, Virgin Island lang mapupuntahan. If you want to go to other islands pa, may additional ka lang ng mga at least 300 to 500, depende sa destination. Ano na yung mga boats over here? We have arrived at the major stop here in our island happy. This is the Virgin Island. As you can see, guys, ang ganda ng dagat dito. In fairness, the Virgin Island, ha? In fairness, dumalaban po siya sa balabang. At saka sa Boracay. Yeah, so I think we'll be having our lunch here. And then, uh, we'll stay longer here. Of course, expected. So the entrance here is 350 pesos. But of course, as you can see, the beach Oh, no, man.
So, tapos na kami nag-island hopping. Ngayon tatali si dalawang island na talaga siya. Hilantagan at saka doon sa ano, sa Virgin Island. So, mesmerizing pa rin yung Virgin Island up until now. So, currently, nandito na kami ngayon sa Kota Beach. Back at the hotel. So, mag-i-release na tayo. Tapos, we'll check yun naman the beach later. Then, later at evening is kapunta tayo ng MG Square for the day night. Tapos, packing things. Then, by tomorrow is to check out na kami as early as 7 a.m. Kasi we will be flying back pa to Davao at around 6 p.m. tomorrow. So, yun lang muna yung compresses ng ating day 2 dito sa Bantayan. So, just free lang siya na vacation, guys. Short vacation. We are off to MJ Square for dinner. Mom and Dad, Auntie, lahat. We are staying here at the third row of the beach sa Kota. We are at the MJ Square. Dito siya banda. Tapos, going there. May mga shops. Pwede na kayo mamili dito ng mga pasalubong. Pwede na kayo mamili dito ng mga my big chill shops, okay. the Amazon, Kristen. Lively MJ Squares. Breakfast, 135. I'm in the mirror. Morning and morning, Father. Pa. Are we the going home? Huh? Oi! <laughs> Bye, Bantai! Kela, <laughs> Perkin. Ha 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 guys. Balot kayo. We have arrived at the Hagnay Airport. And guys, we're an exiting Hagnay Airport. May mga basas. Get on that bus going to Cebu. So the DIY in Tampayan is very easy. Up, 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 up,
going to back to Delta. We are now boarding Father Dear. Kaya mo yan, Father Dear. We're almost there to the finish line. Look at it. Touchdown Davao City. This uh, this marks the end of our vlog here in our family trip. No? Family trip going to Pantaya together with the seniors. So maybe a, a bit challenging siya talaga siya when you travel with uh, senior citizen. But nevertheless, it's fulfilling. It's happy, and I'm so happy that my parents are traveling with me so this marks the end of our trip so see you again in our next uh, oh. see you again in our next travel video bye bye